Sorry, our camera guy. I don't know. I think he's been. Are you drinking, dude? <laughs> it's the shadow from going okay. in between. Okay. 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 The shadow nonstop here in the garage, and then back out in the sun. Right, I'm doing okay. the best I can. Here's the new mower. Let's pan down. Let's show them the new mower. Okay. All right. Okay. So this is the Toro Commercial 30-inch Turf Master. I think it's just called Turf Master, but it's the commercial version of the Time Master. So basically, the story behind why they made this. This is just what I've heard. What they told me is because when they made the Time Master for residential use for homeowners, uh, a lot of landscapers were buying it, including myself, I bought two of them, and they started using it because it was quicker than a 21 inch mower, but it wasn't built to cut, you know, how many, however many properties you cut. It wasn't meant to cut 20, 30 properties with the push mower a week. It was meant to do one yard per week, or however you want to do that, but it was made for homeowners. so. A couple years later down the line, they built the, the commercial version, which is called the Turf Master. So that's basically what this is. Uh, they sent this out to me to try out and to use it, to, to, to see what my thoughts were on it. So we're gonna be using it and uh, replacing it, replacing the Time Master with the Turf Master. So I'm gonna give you, go over a couple things here. So as you guys notice right off the top, is this is plastic on the Time Master. So basically they replaced a lot of the plastic parts that the Time Master has with steel. Isn't that steel, Andy? Andy, is that steel? I'd say it's steel-ish. <laughs> it's a lot stronger. But if this steel, I don't know what it is. It's definitely a very heavier gauge. It's a than heavy this. gauge. Like this is, you can just tell this is a lot thinner and this goes all the way up. So another thing that's really nice 
if you guys see here, there's supposed to be a handle. This has broken so much on the Time Master. So they replaced that. If you want to come in closer here, Andy, right here, they replaced the, the, the deck adjustment with an all steel and that you just lift up right there. It's really easy and you could change the height from there. Also put a little guard, just really strengthened everything up. I'm not, you could just tell whenever you're using the Time Master that everything's just a little bit shaky and not as sturdy. So this commercial version is really strong. I'm really excited about it. It's really awesome. So the gas tank's bigger. I don't know how much bigger. I'm not sure on the size. We can look up the specs. It's a one gallon. This is it one gallon? It's a one gallon. It's a one gallon. What engine's on here? Kawasaki. Kawasaki. Briggs and Stratton on the Time Master. All right, let's look back at the controls. So it's a lot sturdier, you know, it's gonna last a lot longer whenever you're doing commercial stuff. So the, another difference right here, personal pace. I, I had no complaints with the personal pace. I love the Time Master. It was just that, it was just not made for, for what we do. So the controls on this, here's your, here's your speed. Right here, your blade engaged. Um, my one thing that I, the, the thing that I really liked about the Time Master was this adjustment. It's so easy to adjust like this and even fold it like this. I really like that, especially for the trailer and for storage. This one, there's just bolts down here. That's probably my one thing. It just it you can't condense it down as much as the Time Master. But once again, this was made for a homeowner's garage to fold in nice and compact. So that's my little overview. We took some footage with it today. That's my little overview of the new mower. So I'm excited. I loved it. Love using it. And uh, again, the, the another difference of starting it right here is your blade or your your engine off. They move that down to here. So your choke, then you can go from, from, you know, what is that, low RPMs or it's, slow. It's variable speed. Yeah, variable speed, but like turtle mode, the bunny rabbit mode, okay? <laughs> and then your stop right there. So everything, uh, then you got, looks like a bigger, bigger oil filter, like an actual oil filter, like what you'd see on a bigger mower. And also the air filter is right here as well, so. Super exciting stuff. And uh, you know you're gonna see that in more videos. I'll let you guys know. I just wanted to give you a little first look. Let you guys know what's happening. So, exciting stuff, man. I really, really like it. Also, look at this hat. I really like this hat. So the guys there, man, they're awesome. They delivered this yesterday. You guys probably saw on Instagram. Um, exciting, exciting stuff. We'll get back to you guys next time. Enjoy some of this footage with the drone and with Andy's camera because, you know, my camera's coming back. I think this week they finally got it fixed. It's been dead since the GIE Expo, but uh, Andy, I appreciate it. Make sure you guys subscribe to Andy. Andy, you're almost to 3,000, right? I'm coming close to it, guys. I'm right Dude, around 3,000. You know, I think Andy just got sick of me I did. after I like the GIE. But he's back now. I he guess. just sings yeah. nonstop. The shower, brushing, it doesn't matter. He's just <laughs> singing and singing. And we got Nick over here. What's up? He's been hey, mowing. Man. He's been running this all day, man. Oh yeah. So uh it's Nick, awesome. Nick, what do you what what, 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 what Time Master, what do you what do you see the biggest difference? Is the cut quality different or is it just mostly the quality of the machine? <clears throat> uh, it's a combination of both. The quality of the machine is is huge, huge difference. Especially the deck. Um, cut quality, I, I don't know yet. We'll have to wait till next summer. The Time to see Master, I had no complaints on the cut quality. The Time Master cuts great. Yeah, like, it cuts awesome. But we don't again, know how much better this is going to be until the grass is longer next year. So. Mostly, sorry, our camera guy, I don't know. I think he's been. Are you drinking, dude? <laughs> it's the shadow from going okay, in between. Like, okay, okay. The shadow nonstop here in the garage and then back out in the sun. Right, I'm doing okay. the best I can. So for what uh, you guys are giving me. But we're talking about the build quality. That's mostly what it is. This is made for, for professional landscapers or whatever. Uh, whatever you call me or yourself or whoever. It's made for more use and more cuts than a residential mower. So that's it, guys. That's my little first look. Hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you later. Thanks for watching. <laughs>